So we had to park on the fifth floor and uh, well, two lifts out of action there and uh, this one also out of service. So out of the four lifts, there's only one that's actually working. Well, today is the 10th of April, it's 2024 and we're in a lift. We're at the airport and it's time for and we're going into the airport. We're coming up out on the fourth floor. Uh, we can actually walk straight into the airport. We don't have to go outside. We can do the escalator. The escalators are working. It's just the lifts that seem to be a problem. And uh, the park, car park in general is a bit of an issue because lots of it's either used for renter cars or it's full of cars that seem to be permanently parked there, which is really strange. And they're still doing a lot of work. This part of the airport here, which is on the fourth floor, has been in the past a check-in area, but not anymore. So it tends to be a little bit of a meeting point. Actually, have got some vending machines, so you can get yourself a drink. Walk along here on the fourth floor, you can just walk straight into the terminal. It's quite a long walk, everything's a long walk in <laughs> Palmer Airport, and uh, hopefully, the, the moving walkway is, is moving and we'll be able to speed ourselves along a little bit and uh, we'll catch up when we get on the other side. But just before we do that, there are some boards here where you can check your flight to make sure everything's okay. We'll just carry on there. Once you get to this stage, if you only have your hand luggage, you can just walk to the either end, both ends you can go to, to security, or in our case we've got to go and check a bag in, so we've got to go down a level. If you only got hand luggage, just go straight to the security. We're going to go down, down there. Are we going down or up? We're going down. Are you down or up, Luna? Down. Down. You ready? Right. Go ahead and go down. Go down. We had a lovely walk this morning, didn't we? I was Going down. Down we go. Where's your check-in desk? Want to do this time? Yeah. Have to look at the board. Check-in desk. Find the check-in oh, desk. This side, isn't Is it right there? Yeah. yeah. I think it's right down yeah, at the end. Typical, eh? Come on, girls. So out we go, and just at the bottom here, you've got the board, and you can find where your check-in desk is, which is where you have to take your luggage. So you can just look up there, look for the time of your flight. Oh, pardon. And just noticeably more people around now. W.H. Smiths. Lots of those once you pass security as well, so not a problem. No, no, we're I think we've got to go all the way to the end here to find <laughs> uh, the Ryanair checking desk so we can do the bag drop off. Yeah. Uh, I there are places it. for coffee, drinks yep. here, but lots more on the other side as well. Here we are, this is the Ryanair area. Uh, when the summer season really starts, this will get very busy down here. Lots of in and out and in and out. And then uh, back drop off. I think actually they're very lucky today because there's uh, virtually no queue at all. Looks like they'll go straight to check in and get rid of the bag. Brilliant. That's it, back checked in and ready to go. This way, this way, no, no, no. All good? 
Were, were you overweight? 19.7. Whoa. That's touching the limit. I think they're training up lots of new people though. So what's that? Up we go. Up we go. Up we go. I am. Coming up after you. I'll catch you up, don't worry. My blue sky. The thing about the Ryanair, because it's right through getting numbers 1 to 17, it's right by the security. It's just very quiet, isn't it? It's a quiet time of the year. So security should be fairly straightforward. But well, this is the point at which we can't go any further. Well, at the time's come, we've got to say goodbye to them all. Everyone's going. It. They're off now, they're going through the airport and uh, well, I'm sure they'll be in touch when we get, we get to the other side. So thanks very much for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Bye for now. So we've just gone through security, absolutely zero problems, which is great. So miss you granddad, miss you nana. We've just been through duty free and now we're heading into the uh, main part of the airport really we'll get some food and Burger King yes you want a video okay here you go point it so straight there Well done, Savannah. See you soon. See you soon. So Savannah's fr found a, a friend. How many girls? What is it? Is it a buffalo or is it a bull? Hey, good girls. And now we're just heading to our terminal. Well, we don't know the exact one yet, but it's a something. So if we just stay in the vicinity until we uh, get our information on the board and off the girls go. Go girls. Super fast. What are you doing, Anna? So we just got past second part of security with no problems. Passport control. Passport control. Looks like they're doing a bit of new construction. We're heading into the terminals now, just to go wait for our plane, which takes off, I guess, 1.40. See you soon. I just thought how young she'll be. There's a plane just taking off. That's our Ryanair plane there. That one over there. And they've just been announced that we're going to start boarding in a minute. 45 minutes early. Sí. Sí, ese es nuestro avión. Sí. That 
for walking backwards. Mm, yeah. Lots going on out there. Lots of big windows. Nice of the girls to look at. So we're on the plane now, ready to leave Mallorca, just waiting to uh, take off. Savannah, who are you sat with today? Uh, Daddy. Daddy. And oh, we don't want to go home, do we? We want to stay in Mallorca, don't we? Yeah, but then our own granddad. Yeah. Yeah. Right, we'll see you on the other side. Serena and uh, Fargo, Serena and uh, Luna are sat three seats behind us, or two seats behind us, whatever it is. Um, so yeah, we'll see you on the other side in miserable England. <laughs> so we've landed and we're back in Bristol. Are you alright girls? Savannah, you alright? Yeah. Not yet, Baba. So we're just going to catch the bus to the Silver Zone, uh, Silver Zone, sorry, and get the uh, car and head back to Wilchester and go get the dog. But yeah, we'll see you all soon. Bye bye. Now we've just got to the Silver Zone and we're going to get our car key and go home. It was a lovely holiday. Um, it was really hot actually for this time of year in Mallorca but um, yeah, can't wait to go back next time hopefully not too long take care guys, bye bye